You know, a lot of people, when they think about chiropractors, they don't really think about kids going to chiropractors, but it is probably a necessity, especially if you have a really active kid. They might have some uh, issues, uh, health issues, that chiropractic work could actually help them out. So we brought in today a gentleman that uh, works a lot with children, Dr. Richard Urich. How are you? It's good to see you Jim, again. Jim, nice to see you. Good morning. Good to be here. Thank you. Give us a little bit. I mean, spinal care for kids, as you put it, can be compared to getting a regular dental checkup. Moms and dads, you take your kids to the dentist for what? Make sure their teeth are properly aligned and you do that periodically. Well, you should do the same thing with your children. A lot of the times with children with sports like gymnastics or falling off their bike or things like that. Football. Their, you know. their spines get out of alignment and, you know, the only person who can really check it properly is a chiropractor. It's a 10-minute screening, which I, I, I offer in my office for free. I don't charge for that. And a lot of the times I'll find imbalances, Jim, in the mm -hmm. spine that if they grew up with can develop problems later on in life, not just back pain, but stomach right. problems and things like that. So if we balance out their body and allow the body to take care of itself, my philosophy is if you balance out the body and allow the body to heal itself, then we don't have to treat symptoms. I don't treat symptoms as a chiropractor. I make sure the body is properly aligned so we can remove the nerve interference so the body can heal itself. Well, I mean, and there are a lot of things that you that you mentioned uh, that you and I just you're talking off camera, um, ear infections, right. uh, behavioral issues, right. uh, respiratory, bladder, bowel problems, right, right. Um, and you said uh, even you mentioned about uh, children with autism, even things like autism. Now, we, you know, I'm not saying that we can cure autism, but I, I deal with the nervous system. My specialty is the nervous system. Autism is a nervous system disorder for whatever reason. Right. You know, we don't have to go into the reasons, but if we can go ahead and detect that there's any problem, especially in the upper cervical spine and the mm -hmm. upper part of the neck, you know, where the, the brain stem comes out, right. if we can take the, the pressure off of that, we can help with some of the symptoms. I'm not saying we can cure this, but we can help with some of the symptoms and maybe have some of the moms and dads get them off some of the drugs that they're on because some of these ADD and ADH drugs and autistic drugs can affect their brains. It can affect, literally affect the formations of their brains because we're only talking about four and five and six-year-old kids and their brains aren't fully developed until they're 15 or 20 years old. So I encourage parents, if you have not checked out a chiropractor, myself or anybody else who deals with children, please do so. Please do so sooner than later. And uh, you talk about sooner. I mean, what's the youngest that you usually can work with children, uh, you know, to see, I mean, as you said, um, to, to look them over, consultation or whatever, uh, and, and see if they need some uh, help? Well, a lot of parents will say it's okay for me, Dr. Urich, you can treat me, but not my children. I've actually treated and, and examined children right out of the womb. What you basically do is you lay them on their mom's lap or you lay them on their mom's belly, and just like you're checking the ripeness of a tomato, mm -hmm. that's basically what we do with our thumbs and our fingers to check and see if there are little spinal imbalances. And we balance that out and things like colic goes away, uh, ear infections can go away, and all kinds of different problems, you know. And there's a lot of chiropractors that are doing this, not just me. But I want to specialize in this because I want people to know that we need to go ahead and get your children. Too many children are taking too many drugs, my yeah. opinion. Too many drugs. Well, a lot now, of adults are needed, doing it too, trying to mask that pain, as you exactly mentioned. Right. I mean, that your whole nervous system, you know, runs through you and, and, and pretty much uh, governs the way that so much of you feel. And, right. and I mean, the spinal column and all that that runs through there, and you've got to do some adjustments right. to it. And that's what's important about right. that is, right. uh, you know, do, doing uh, The analogy that, that I always give, it's if you're driving your car and you feel a little shake in your car, you're realizing the car is beginning to get out of alignment. Mm -hmm. Now, if you change the tires, are you fixing the problem? You're not. You're treating a symptom. You have to make sure that you align that car so the front end doesn't start to fall apart. The same thing with the body. If your body's out of alignment, eventually the body will not function the way that God made it to function. Hmm. Well, uh, listen, we got a few minutes left. I want to talk about one of the other things that you do. You're also a health coach. Right. Give us a little bit of insight as to actually what you do as a health coach. Well, I used to, used to say nutritional counselor. I still am, but health coach I like because basically like a football coach, if you need the coach to go ahead and help you with certain things, and that's the same thing with me. Patients will come in. And we do a detailed history, a detailed, detailed history. And then over four or five sessions, what we'll do is we'll connect the dots. For mm -hmm. instance, somebody has a thyroid problem. Right. Well, that could be coming from their gut. If somebody has gout, that could be coming from their kidneys. So just because you have a problem in a certain part of your body, 
It could be coming from somewhere else. The body is all interconnected, and we teach people that. And what I, what I really like to say is that we empower people. I'm a teacher. I like to teach people as I go along. And as we empower people, get them off medications, get them onto a healthier lifestyle, and then they're on their own. And as a coach, they want to come back to me a month later, six months later, and say, hey, I need help with this. Want to get people out of that revolving door of the medication revolving door mm -hmm. where they got to keep going back for a new prescription and a new prescription. And again, there are drugs that are necessary, but there are a lot of people taking medications that maybe are not necessary. If we got them on a healthier lifestyle, we can get them off of that and change how they think, get them on an exercise program, which is part of it, work on their stress level, proper rest. It's all encompassing. It's not just about well, food. Well, you've been doing nutritional counseling for 17 years. A long time. For, for quite a while. A so, long time. And a lot of people don't realize that their diet plays right. so much importance. Right into living a healthier lifestyle. That's exactly right. I mean, and it's what you put in is going to govern mm -hmm. whether, as you said, you're going to have gout, you're going to have other problems, right. things like this, right. obesity, and right. things like that. So, you know, being, um, you know, giving some counseling on, on the direction to go with that, right. that's very important. We've gotten pretty good results, too. There's, there's an expression that we use in the natural health care uh, uh, profession called G-I-G-O, mm -hmm. garbage in, garbage out. If you continually put garbage type foods into your body, you can't expect as you get older to have a good, healthy body. You won't because you'll have reactions. You'll have symptoms later on that may take 20 or 30 years. Now, I don't mean to be crude by saying that, but it's so true. If you put the right fuel in your body, I have an 80-20 rule. If you put 80 percent, now this is if you don't have diabetes or any health conditions, 80 percent good fuel in your body, you can get away with 20 percent junk. Wow. You can. If you do not, if you're putting in like 60% junk and 40% good fuel, you're not going to have a healthy well, body. And we're symptoms not will be 20 or 30 years down the road. Our bodies are not like cars. We can trade in our cars That's when right. it starts to run down or anything. That's right. This is one shot. you got one shot right here. So the, exactly the, you know, right. the, the best thing that you can do That's is right. take good care of it, live a healthier lifestyle, right. and live a, you know, a great long life. That's exactly right. So that's, uh, you know, those, those things are very important. Yeah. Want to mention where you're located. You are located up in the Nord Village Shopping Center, right. uh, where Wendy's is, back in the corner there right. in the same building with Coast Health and Nutrition. Right. Right. Uh, phone number is on your screen if you would like to make an appointment. Um, and as far as, you right. know, give them a call, find out what, what, hour, what uh, hours you're there. Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and I'd like to reiterate, if you have children, I do screenings for free, so you can call me. We can bring them in any time. All right. Dr. Richard Urich, chiropractor. Appreciate Thank you so it, much for being on the show today. Thank you. Again, if you want some more information, the phone number is on your screen. Give them a call, and especially if you have any children, it would be great to do that, too. Thank you.